I was told that I couldn't overdo my last sandwich, but I'm gonna try. Today I'm gonna make an Italian po' boy. And I'm gonna show you just how it all comes together. All right, let's get started. Now, first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna lay down a little piece of parchment paper. And we're gonna come in here with some ham. My, what I'm trying to do is heat up my meat because I want it all nice and hot on top of the sub. Put a little bit of, little bit of organization to that. Then I'm gonna come back and top it off with my salami. Come back, I'm gonna top it off one more time with some pepperoni. There we go, that's beautiful. And last but not least, lay the cheese on. Now this is provolone cheese. Now the, the goal is to have this stuff melt beautifully right on top of it. So that's why I'm gonna use the dome next. So we're gonna cover it. All that heat's gonna be baking that meat and just making it. We don't wanna cook the meat. All we wanna do is just make it where the meat is nice and warm and the cheese is melted on top. So. The next thing we're going to be doing is just taking some cheese, taking the uh, butter. I'm going to spray the inside of it. All I want to do is lay the bread, get a little bit of toast to it. Make the bread nice and warm. So we're just going to hang tight for a few minutes and we'll be right back. Hey, time to look at the bread. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice and toasted. Turn it over. First thing we want to do, put a little bit of mayonnaise on it. There we go. I don't know about you guys, but I love mayonnaise on mine. There we go. Thank you, probably. Look, let's take a peek at our uh, meat. Yep, look at it. It's starting to. It ain't going to be much longer before that's good and ready to go. So, let's get the bread off. We're going to put it on the counter. We already know what we're doing. Now we are to the magic moment. Let's get to the meat and see what it looks like. That's absolutely what we want. Now, being that it's on parchment paper, it should be pretty easy to roll right off, right onto the meat where we want it to go. Hold on. I'm gonna move that off the board here a second. Put that up here. We're gonna lay that right on top. Oh my goodness. That is going to be perfect. Look at that. Absolutely perfect. So, now, since we got that on, now I need to dress it up a little bit. So, first thing we're gonna do, I think we're gonna add us a little bit of lettuce. Get us some nice, beautiful tomatoes on top. Then I'm gonna come back, add some red onion. Oh, we love our red onions. Now, that's a perfect sandwich. So, the only thing that I got left, and that's to put on my Italian dressing. So, it ain't gonna take a bunch, but we're just gonna let it drip all over the vegetables, down into the meat. There we go. I don't see where I can't get better than that. So, last and final, but not least, the lid folks that's how you make an italian sandwich hope you're going to enjoy the video and if you uh, liked it i appreciate it if you like and subscribe to my page